That's a garden spider. Gross. No, they're nice. Nah. It's not gross. Kill it with fire. Yes. Yeah, oh, connection. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. Sorry, Mike. <laughs> there, that's today's batch. Somebody's gonna Photoshop one of those, and I'm gonna buy a house somewhere. See it coming. Mm. Oh, you need me for something. Yeah. Okay, I'll be back. Another highly layered roof. It can't be as bad as the other ones. One would hope. Well, this back for a ladder. Who is? All right. Hey there, guys. Welcome to today's Captain's Blog. It's Friday, September 19th, 2014, at 13:28 hours, and we are ripping off the nasty roof of Geek House Five because roofer dudes are coming tomorrow to put the new roof on for reals. But because we're low budget, we do the demolition ourselves because anybody can do that. It's okay, we have a maintenance. With the power of ten men. Well, maybe two. And a half. First piece in the new dumpster. This is dumpster two. <laughs> All right. This roof and that roof get peeled off. Entirely possible. So very much not mourn the loss of those stairs. Anybody got a razor knife with them? Huh? All right, because we can, we can just slice that with a razor knife, peel back. That's an EPDM roof. Yeah. Careful. So that'll come right off. Another ship that we really. Hey, check that out. Look at the peak. It tells us this used to be a pitched roof. That's where it connected. This house has had several additions over the years. That didn't used to be there. Yeah. The, the second story used to end where that corner is.
that's a garden spider. Gross. No, they're nice. Eh. It's not gross. Kill it with fire. Yes. Yeah, that was connection. Ah! <laughs> 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 ah! I'm gonna die. <laughs> Where'd he go? Run around on the tiny, unstable roof. I lost the spider. It's right probably there. Crawling down the back. Where is he? Oh, he's over here now. Okay. It's so hard with why you brought it out. Can make the friends with the Now, spiders are okay as long as they're outside and not touching me. Chris, guess what? what? Gravel. Huh? Bar. Gravel. No. Yeah. Really? Look. Oh my god. What? That is so messed up. Let's just keep piling on what? layers. The top layer comes off, comes off pretty damn easy when you get the edges off. Wow. Ain't that shit. They just put a whole layer right over the... Welcome to the west side. See, this is why we're not fixing the roof. We're ripping it off and getting a new one put on. You know what's even more disturbing that there's gravel here? Wet. That it's wet. Yeah, <laughs> I kind of told you it was wet. Look a piece, you throw it in the Toss the whole thing over the side and then lift it up together and put it in the dumpster. That'd be how I'd do it. You go ahead and do that. I'll watch. <laughs> You're gonna, it's going to take a lot more energy to cut it up into pieces. Yeah. That's the ice spill dust, Steven. Come on. How does this come off? Right, Same way as every other layer. You... Grab an edge, tear a hole, peel it off. Okay. Same shit, just in a different flavor. Elise and Rose, get down here and start working on this lower level. This needs a little tear in it. You work that tear bigger and bigger, and there's no roof left. Yeah, let's see. I got an idea. Let's stop what we're doing right now. Yeah. Lay it back out. Come from this way. That way we can just. Okay. I like that idea. So this just instantly became the girl team? Yep. Okay. <laughs> That's right. Hey, uh... It's alarmingly soft under this. Using that pry bar? No, you need it? 
Yeah. Thank you, sir. Okay, maybe not. Oh, by the way, guys, the last dumpster that left was 27,000 pounds. I believe it. Yeah. Uh. yeah. Need a knife? Look around inside. inside. Shovel! <laughs> uh, no. Excuse me? Could work, but... Call your boyfriend tell him to bring back security knife and ask why he's not back yet. He is bringing knives. He's, he's bringing safety knives, security yes. knives, or utility knives. Utility knives, that's it. He's bringing knives. Oh, I saw you pull it out and I was like, oh, hey. Okay. Hey, and I can't call him anymore. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Why? No phone. Who no phone? No phone. Why no phone? He's here anyway. Because I think this will work here. Guys, yes. it's a lot easier if you rip off the entire black layer and then that comes out in big boards, probably. Yeah. That's what I do. Okay. <laughs> Judging by the little rings everywhere, that sheeting is nailed down. No, it is. And you can pop the nails out and then the whole sheet comes out as a sheet. Yep. Up there. On this roof to get to that roof. Thank you, sir. Doogie, help them slice and dice that roof.
Jerry, grab that crowbar behind Minkus. Just set the lighter inside. Yeah, let's. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Just set the ladder in that corner. There's some shit. Or by right here. Okay. From hell's heart, I stab at thee. It's like Caligula against Poseidon. Caligula didn't personally fight Poseidon. He no, he had his into troops the into the ocean, stabbing at the waves. I don't see how that's anything like what I was just doing. Uh, as the Especially best. Especially since they would be using. I only had two stabby death things in my head. Then. Okay, I had two stabby death things in my head. That, and I'm probably the only other human being you know that would get the Caligula Poseidon reference. I know plenty of people. You hang out with weird people. Uh, I need more. Gary? Yeah, give me one of those rubbers. And I can prove that you're weird. What's Caligula's real name? What? Tiny Boots. <laughs> <laughs> what, what's his full name? I don't fucking know. They're all Imperator Augustus Romulus Bullshitus. Once they ascend anyway. I'm pretty sure, I could have it wrong, but I think Caligula was Gaius Caesar Augustus Germanicus. Okay. I think. Tiny boots? That's what Caligula means. Tiny boots? Yeah. That's why I hated the name. See, I didn't know that. Oh, okay. Well, that's going to be fun. Although I'm just doing this to try and lift it up. Oh! See if we can't roll the whole thing up. Okay. Gary, can you come here a second? No. Hold on, Steven. Put it on to the other end and just lift up on that. Okay, at that very corner, not at the outside. Right. Okay. Temperatures already exceeded the biggest working factor. Yeah? Look at the shirt! Hey, I've been wondering where the hell you were. Okay, so supposedly, you take these rings out. Also, the T-Rex in your shirt has three fingers. Those are probably screws. They might zip right out. They are screws. They are screws. Okay. We don't have a screw gun here, do we? Yeah, that would be a really long time doing. Yeah, you don't want you want to do that. I'll go get a screwdriver. No, she can go get a screwdriver. Somebody there does. In the tool room. Batman's back. In the tool room, man. All right, then. If Batman's back, get him on the radio. Hey, Batman, you on comms? I need a screw shooter, uh, preferably the impact with a number two Phillips.
Cool. Tell him to bring it over to five. Thank you. You yeah. broke it? Yeah. Told you. That takes Jeez. doing. No, not really. It's a wooden handle. Oh, you just broke the handle? Yeah. That doesn't want to go in. Where's my hammer? Just grab the thing and toss it over. Just grab the thing and toss it over, he says, referring to the 500 pound piece of tar and asphalt. <coughs> All three of you grab the thing and toss it over. I brought the framing hammer. That might cut that better. He's holding the framing hammer. He's holding his own personal rage I hammer. Other ones. The ones I was putting holes in the cars with. Oh, that's oh. Oh. I'm going to mess you up, uh, European hammer. Son of a bitch! He made it! Minkus gets the three-pointer.
spot. Oh, you got one? Alright. Yeah, yeah, that that somebody probably had a hibachi sitting there or something, but that's very, very burned. So we peeled back the uh, the metal edging on the parapet. <laughs> I haven't heard the word parapet used that way before. I don't know a better name for it. What it is? Parapet all over Michigan. There are bridges. Yeah. Huh? No, get back to the metal and then stop. Yeah. Get get the rubber off. Leave the metal. Do the best you can. Our job is to do like 99% of it. The roofer dudes will handle the little bit that's left. Oh dear God. Yeah. Hang on, show them what you got there. I have uh, what the was apparently holding the roof together, which was in fact seven, eight layers of patching. Wow. Plus that last layer that we already took off. And, and what remains is? The downstairs floor. Yeah. Wow. All right. So that would explain our leak a little bit. Yeah, yeah. That, that might have something to do with it. Christ. I'll get there. Just keep clearing it out. When all that's left is the screws, I'll come through and blast them all. I got like 50 of them. There's only got to be a couple left. Floor. Hey, at least we 
Yeah, yeah, just okay. pop it all right off. Well, no, leave the wood. Leave that wood. Because dude will sort that out. Okay. Let's just get down to the bear later, though. Everywhere else. Man, someone's been hacking the nails here. Holy hell. Here we go, we got a style. Nails have gone out of style. Because when those were laid, nails were, in fact, going out of style. You got some good scrap here, Chris. There's plenty of copper right here. Yeah? That's all copper right there. Ah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's old copper roof flashing. They are putting all new everything everywhere. Yes, we did that upstairs. They're doing it down here too. Ah. All right, so you got a few screws left that need zipping? Yeah, like there, ah. over there. Where's that thing? Oh, okay. Here, drive that as a thing. Okay.
think that's all of them? I think so. I'm sure there's a couple we missed, but we're good. Here. Where? Oh, I can get them here. Give me a second. And then there's two down here. All right. Where did the water come from? That's what we're trying to figure out. That's why I told you earlier, why is it leaking? Right here. Alright, well, get that water off the particle board. Do we have anything any, like a... Do you have any tissue or anything? Someone say my name? Yeah, yeah come over here and take a look at this. I bet you this is, this is an indication of what this roof looks like, like it did up there. Look how many layers there are. Awesome. I couldn't be more excited about that. Oh, Yay! Yeah, I see it, I see it. The roof is an onion, Chris. Oh, I know. Layers and layers and layers of stinky shit. makes you cry. Stinky shit. There's probably more under there. Yeah, I like his addendum. It is an onion. As you peel back the many layers, the more you see, the makes you cry. Oh, I was gonna say it's a balaclava, man. Oh, concentrated shit. I'm sure there's one more in that corner, but we haven't unearthed it yet. Alright, unearthed it. I'll get it. Okay. Um, Alright, let's get that out of there. Yeah. Here, we'll do it the way you can do what you need to. Yeah. Oh, you water in that pole, maybe. Here that's what I'm thinking. I appreciate it. Wow! Oh, that's class. Oh. baby. Right there, ratings went up 10 points. Huh? Huh? No. Nah. Harry little bastard Jerry. up there. Jerry the domesticated yeti. Steven actually has a sound for it from a previous video series he did years ago when in college. Your Yetis are wrong? That was also a woman. Yeah? His name was Jeff. Jeff. So, Steven, that hole looks like an on-purpose hole. Yes. Okay. And you, yes, sir. Um, get down there, please. Okay. And let's get what's not in the dumpster into the dumpster. Okay. Okay. We'll finish right here. All right. And then I do okay. <laughs> In several states in the USA, it's still legal for an employer to discriminate against an employee based on sexual preference and orientation. Being gay, lesbian, or transgender is a fireable offense, and that's bullshit. So... Give me your twinks! Your bears! Your lipstick lesbians yearning to code PHP! Give me your dykes! Your kinksters! Your furries! And transgenders looking for more! Send these! The rainbowed sparkly code poets to me! Compile with us! We don't care whom you adore! Seriously, folks, are you LGBTQ or a champion for their cause? Do you have mad web developing skills? Then we want to talk to you. 
Visit this link and fill out an application today. Where you are in the world doesn't matter, so get in touch. Straight, bigoted asshats need not apply. In fact, we'll laugh at you if you do.